Okay, welcome back, you in nine yo yos. <laughs> uh, I made a video similar to this recently. Um, I got a lot of comments. A lot of people wanted this thing. Um, I'm, I've been, I've been touting this Winkier. I don't know what version this is. I think there's a second version. I don't know if it really matters. Um, basically, if you hit the button, it does some codes. Basically, it's USB. It connects to your computer, or you don't have to have it. You can key with it directly into your keyer right here. You can key and just play with it without having a computer or radio. Um, and it also does, it, it's software based, so you can do some software things with it. And I'm gonna show you that right now. First of all, let's just play with this thing. What happens if I disconnect it from the USB, okay? Now, if I tap on this, okay? Now let's turn it up. I think that's up. Let's turn it all the way up. So if you're in your car or something, you can kind of play around with. You can do it like that um, and kind of pretend like you're sending a cue. So like, hi there. I'm going so slow that I'm not used to it. Hi there. Okay, so now when we connect it to our computer, it goes into a COM port, and it's pretty much automatic, you know. Once you do that, the speed on here doesn't matter. So let me show you something that you can do with this, and as I screw around with this, the camera gets messed up. Okay, as I screwed around with that, the camera got messed up. All right, so if we go into the software, which may be a little hard to see, I have up here a folder I call radio, and this is these are some tools that come with it, and I've kind of forgotten what these are, so let's just kind of go through and see what happens. Okay, so these are some things that you can do to modify sort of like the, the software on the wind here. So I can't, I don't really remember a lot of these things, but what you do is you can, you can type in a message like, hi there or whatever, CQ, and you can write that to the device. And then once you do that, you can hit a button and it will come up automatically. Um, you can configure, all these are configurations for your device. And you can set the max word per minute and min word per minimum. And then whatever your dial does, it will do that. You can go from zero to 20, uh, 10 to 50 or whatever. These are configurations using the WinCare tools, and these are downloadable with the WinCare, and there are ways to configure. Let's see what else is there. There's Cytone frequency. You can change that. There's a COM port, COM port 3. That's where I happen to be right now. I just kind of found it automatically. You can program these pre-messages in there. Uh, looks like there's two message banks, 1 through 12. Not sure how you get to them. Um, anyway, there's lots of uh, settings in here, and if you hit write, you can... Let's do this right now. Let's hit read, read wink here, and I think what it'll do is it'll take all my settings from the wink here and pu pull them and put them in here in the settings. Okay, there it is. So I have, if you notice, can you see it? Let me make it bigger. So we have, uh, right now I have it, 35 words per minute is the max, 5... Is, a, is the minimum, command, current, ratio, not sh weight, lead in. A lot of these, I don't know what they are. Um, but you can do a lot of your settings right here. There's iambic A, iambic B. Just so you know, there are configurations, and you can write to this box and then take it with you out on the road and, and configure it however you want. All right, now this is it. Uh, let's go back into the iambic master, and that's the game we were playing yesterday. I got lots of... Uh, by the way, I posted the link to download Iambic Master. I posted it in this video and the last video, so if you want to get it, after you get your WinCare, you can use this. Uh, let's open up WinCare. Okay, so let's play around with the Iambic Master now. We've got our score and our scoreboard, and we can set... Um, somebody said, "What would it be easier... Somebody wrote a comment. Would it be easier if you went slower? Let's find out. Let's drop this down... To, now these are just different modes I think in the way the way it forces you to go through the contest a little through the game 
So let's just drop this down to maybe 12 and see what happens. Is it easier to go slower in Iambic Master? Now let's hit start. Oops, I screwed up. Um, yeah, it's easier, but you have to have more patience. Um, and I, I want to get through the game. You know, I want to get through with the game or get through my ten. So let's bring it up to seventeen and, and give that a try. WD zero ECO. Okay, while we're doing this, and I just screwed up, I wanted to show you the iambic method, as you may know, is you're not really supposed to do this for an R. You're not supposed to go... You're not really supposed to do that. You're supposed to go... It's it's two motions, not... So you gotta... It, this is a really good way to practice that, but you gotta force yourself to do it. it can, you can be a little bit struggling you can struggle a little bit because you don't quite want to do it. You don't want to screw it up. It's kind of harder in some ways to do this. The C is really easy. You don't want to do this. You want to do this. You see how it's it's smoother instead of this? All right, there's. right, let's go through the alphabet. Now, the C is a letter where you can hold it down. E. Here's another one. I, I struggle with this. I struggle holding down for two. It's da 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 da. I struggle holding down and hitting just at the right time. It's easier to do, go like this. It's easier to do that, but you're supposed to do this. I struggle doing that. I really do because you have to time it. Just this finger is not that talented. This motion right here is not is not easy. It's not a good muscle motion. So I struggle with the F doing it in the iambic way. So let's move on. A, F, G. K is another one where you can hold it. Don't do this. Mo more motions. You want to do this. Okay. K, L is another one. Oops. See, I have a trouble with L too. See, it's really, it's easier just to do this. instead of this but I think in reality the purist would tell you to do this now somebody told me gave me the advice that your fingers these two fingers your index finger is actually not matched up with the, the, the your thumb and your middle finger so it's actually you may want to consider doing it like this I don't like it though because my this index finger is in the way. I'd rather it was just down. Um, so I'm not going to be doing that. So what were we at? H I J K L M is easy. N P R. That one you got your get your timing right too. You don't have much time to let go. You have to. Sometimes it's easier to swing instead of trying to tap that you swing okay q r s t u w y i like y that was real easy especially since it's in my call sign and then z is kind of a little bit hard too because it's easy to dit one one too many times Okay, so back to Iambic Master. I just wanted to talk a little bit. You can't see it, but if you hit that Win Keyer button, I have just this window displaying. It, it has more settings. This game is pretty simple. I, what I was saying was I wish there was a game. I used to have this typing game when I was in college, and the letters would fall from the sky, kind of like Missile Command. <laughs> have to type and you would have to type each letter and they would disappear but if they got all the way to the bottom in one hit you'd lose 
and they would get faster and faster. I thought that would be a great, that'd be a great game if you could have the letters fall and you'd have to type them out as you went. It's just kind of like a fun game. I learned how to type that way. I'm a really good typer. Um, I actually contacted the the maker of Winkier and because he has some code that would allow you to capture the letters from the Winkier and make your own game. So if you had letters go across or down or something, you could type them and you could make that game. Uh, he never responded though, so and I don't have enough time, but... Anyway, let's go ahead and play this game. I'm going to play it at... I'm going to abort. All right. Now, you can do your run length up to 25 and 50. I'm going to stick with 10 because I kind of lose patience after 10 or I lose concentration. Um, this time, I'm going to try to get it perfect for you. This is live, man. Live. All right. I'm going to kick it on up to 20 instead of 21 like yesterday. My goal is to get all 10 perfect. Very, very difficult to do. But let's give it a try. Here we go, guys. Here we go. I rushed the four and the R and it, and it jammed them together. Got to start all over. All right, um, it is so, so, so picky. If you jam two letters too, just slightly together or just slightly too, part, too far apart, it has to be perfect. I swear this game will make you really good because you'll just start to naturally do these things because it's so picky. It's more picky than you ever really need to be, okay? Um, but I almost wish more keyers out there would do it this good or practice. All right, here we go. All right, screwed up. Ah. All right, some of these are, I think they're deliberately designed to be super tricky. Think about it. K, X, 6, X. Try to tap that out perfectly. Da, 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 da. I mean, whoa. I think they really try to trick you. And then sometimes I seriously will get stuck. I'll get stuck and have to do this like eight or nine times before I get it. This might be boring for you, but I'm doing it anyway. Here we go. All right, that was really tough, uh, really tough. And sometimes you get it perfectly. All right, 
I will say the more you play this, the more you get good at it. And the the numbers are really hard because you gotta gotta go da 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 da. It's so easy to go one extra dit or one extra dash. It's so easy, as you know, especially as you go faster. But like I said, the reason I go faster, like at a twenty, is because if you have to start over, if you screw up when you're going slow, and you have to start all over, you gotta go slow again. So I'd rather just keep it going. All right, let's keep going. Ah, the L. The L, man. It's hard. I was trying to do it that instead of tapping like this. Instead of tapping it out like this. It's hard. Okay, I'm not going to do that anymore. All right, here we go. You notice how I got the L. I just went. I went ahead and went da 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 da. -da. I just swung it instead of uh, trying to do it the iambic style. I just I'm not that good at it. The O and the zero. The O the zero has a slash through it, so that helps. All right, that was way easier than that X, K, E, whatever one. It's pretty hard to go zero and then a T because you you could go D, 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 and you have to space it just right and then D again and then stop. It's very easy to screw that up. The threes, the twos and the threes start to have a riz, rhythm to them. They have a rhythm. They're like... Da 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 da. That's kind of like music. Da 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 for a two. Da 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 for a four. You start to get this sort of a. It's almost like a song. Da 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 da. You know what I mean? And you get good at it. Okay. all right that's it that was 10 10 out of 10 all right thanks for joining me that was fun i would like to see your videos um what do you think of my new brio camera this is very clear very clear camera it's supposed to be 4k it's not 4k it's 1080 um, this thing still slides around. Look at the build quality on this. This is the, this is the Begali Traveler. Why don't I show you on this camera? This is better. Isn't that cool? It's got that soft metal. I've actually kind of abused this a little bit. I've, you know, I kind of throw it in my bag and take it with me. Of course I take care of it, but... You know, I'm not. It's got some dirt in there and stuff. It's got some dirt from just taking it out on the road, right in here. But you know, I I th I think think you should buy things to use. These right here are. I think they're for strap. Sorry, they're straps for your leg to go around your leg, so you can hold it on your leg and tap it out.